Okay, whole numbers, question number two. Here we go. You read the question first. Read to understand sentence by sentence. All right, here we go. Deepa has some money. How much money? We don't know. We don't know how much money Deepa has, but she has some money. All right. And the question says, if she bought 12 kg of durians, if she were to buy 12 kilograms of durian, she would be short of $17. That means she does not have enough money to buy 12 kg of durians. She does not have enough money to buy 12 kg of durians. She will be short of $17. If she bought 8 kg of durians, she would have $9 left. That means she has enough money to buy 8 kg of durians. And there would be some remainder to the amount of money she has. How much is it? It's $9. And we are supposed to find out how much money does Deepak have. So what do we do? Yeah. This is what we do. First of all, we draw a model like this. Now this represents Deepak's money, all right? And the question says, if she were to buy 8 kg of uh, durians, she would have some money left. So I'm going to cut it here. I'm going to assume this is 8 kg. 8 kg, right? 8 kg of durians. And she would have $9 left, remember? $9. So if she bought 8 kg of durians, $9 left. Right, let's read the question again. So the question says, if she bought 12 kg, she would be short of $17. So let's take that in the, in the drawing, all right? Now, this is 8 kg. She would have $9 extra. So let's say 12 kg is roughly around there. Okay? This is 12 kg, and she will be short of $17. Okay, once you... If you get your model to this stage, you can solve the problem, all right? But you see, this part here is $9 plus $17. 9 plus 17, all right? Which is equal to $26. $26 is how many kg? How many kg is $26 of durian? So, when you see this 12, this is 8. So, we can see what the difference is here. 12 minus 8 is 4 kg. 4 kg. If you can see this, imagine drawing this like that, right? You are drawing something there to the 12 kg. This is 8 kg. So 8 kg, 12 kg for the whole bar. 12 minus 8 gives you 4. Right? 8 plus 4 is 12. So what happens next? Um, Alright. 4 kg costs $26, 1 kg costs 26 divided by 4, and this is uh, $6.50. Alright, $6.50. So, if you want to find how much money um, uh, Deepak has, remember, if she bought 8 kg of your hands, she would have nine dollars left. So we can take this to find out what's the price for eight kg. Six fifty times eight, we will get uh, six hundred forty-eight, forty-eight, fifty-two dollars. And you have to plus nine because she has nine dollars extra, and that's sixty-one dollars. So she has. $61, alright? It's quite easy, yeah?